can the dyno jet fix this bike let's find out so i just put the stock map back in the bike from banton hines all right load a tune dyno jet pre-configured tunes you can do it okay this will marry the bike permanently it cannot be undone is that what you want to do yes this device are now married Oh boy. Okay, let's see. To our engine air, full stock. No. All right, let's talk about this tuner. Dino jet licensing. It comes with a license. I've had a lot of questions. I'm going to answer a lot of questions today. Brand new comes with a license. When you hook it to the bike and marry it, that's the marriage license. I talked to Dino Jack because I, I didn't understand this at all. And he said, if you had a mil, a hundred bikes, you would have to buy a hundred license, well, 99 licenses, because this comes with one. So you can use this to tune multiple bikes. You just gotta buy a license for each bike. When you buy this brand new and you marry it, that's the marriage license. So this is already licensed, that's done. Now Fuel Moto will sell you the map or give you a map. So everything goes through Fuel Moto. If you buy through them, they'll give you a map for life. You can tune, retune, change parts. If you don't buy from them, you have to buy a map, a tune from them. It's a hundred bucks, which I gotta do because I bought this off Amazon. I didn't buy it through them. So now I gotta pay a hundred bucks, which I already did, for a map, because this has a cam. And they emailed me the map, so I gotta put that in here yet. So I'm gonna show you all that. I'm gonna answer some questions because I had questions. And um, if you don't have a cam, you could just pick from one of the the listings they have in here. It's close to what they got. Which you should plug it in. First thing, plug it in, marry the thing, go update it, and then you can pick from. You got a bunch of different ones. It took me a while to find mine. It's a True Duels. But if you don't have a cam, you don't have to worry about buying a map. Update it, pick something, and then run an auto cycle, auto tune. Which with a cam, I'm going to see if I can auto tune. I want to see how it runs with just picking something. I want to see how it runs with an auto tune. And then I'm going to pick, and then I'm going to put the map that. It, I'm going to show you on a computer how to put in here, how they did it, what they gave me. I'm going to run, run the bike three times. Just picking something, picking something and auto-tuning it, and then putting their map in that I paid $100 for. So, so questions is, you have to buy a license? No, only if you have multiple bikes. So, if you get your bike dyno-tuned somewhere, you gotta buy a license through them because they're gonna use this or use their own. But once you buy a license, it'll be cheaper the next time you dyno tune your bike because your bike will be licensed, married license to theirs. So if you buy this for your bike and take it to them, it should be cheaper because it's already licensed and ready to go if they're doing with the dyno tuner, dyno jet. So, I'm going to go on a computer. I'm going to show you how to go to Dino Jet or Fuel Moto 
and get a map. It took an hour. I bought it. Hour and a half later, they emailed me a whatever and a PDF file, whatever, and the map was there. I still gotta put that on the here, but I want to show you, show you this, show you the computer, and then we're gonna do some tunes. But I'm gonna answer questions because I had a lot of questions. Marriage license. It's already comes with it. If you have a 99 more bikes, you need 99 by nine marriage license, which are like 200 bucks each. So it costs you 200 bucks a bike. But this is married license, marriage license. All right, let me show you some stuff. Let me show you some stuff. Okay, first we're off. We're gonna do. I didn't. I still don't have the um, the map in here. The bike's already married. I'm gonna load tunes. Not custom yet, cause that's what I'm gonna get from them. Pre configuration. Now mine was. They, they give you all these. Here, just look, we'll just look at one. Basically, it's just exhaust and air cleaner or slip-ons. It's just a, none of these have a cam. That's what I was looking for. If one of these had a cam, no, they don't. So mine, I believe, was on the second page. I think it was 404, 2404. I, I think that was mine. True Duos. This is the one, 114, air-cooled, air cleaner, True Duos. I picked this one because I'm going with the True Duos. I got the... um. Banton Hines true duels, bigger duels, whatever they're called. Okay, so that's what I got. And there it is. Alright, make sure I'm doing this right here. Go to fuel moto. And once you um check out is when you enter your stuff. So we go to EFI tuning. EFI tuners. Oh. Fuel maps. Go to fuel maps. Okay. Here's the support. Right here, if you, I don't know if you can see it is. If you bought it through them, you just gotta get the receipt number or whatever. If not, if you bought it through someone else, you go, you click here, like I did. Now the map is $99. Here, oh, you gotta pick. We got PB1, PB2. So click that, add to cart. Now this is where you put in your And this is where you answer your questions. Why is this thing? The year, the make, the model, the engine, the performance mods you did. You write that all here. You write notes for the tech, anything you want to tell them special. Okay, we got it mounted. First thing we're going to do is we're going to see how it runs with the internal built-in map and then we're going to see how it runs with the map I just paid for mm. so I think mine is 404 True duels. So we'll see how it runs with true duels. And then we'll see how it runs with the map I paid for. And then we're going to see how it runs when I auto tune the map I paid for. Turn the key off for 10 seconds. All right, when we get up to the road, I'll turn the phone back on. All right, this is the 
a pre-programmed take one pre-programmed uh, map see how it runs with the built-in map in the dino jet it actually sounds good takeoff is good so far Takeoff is okay. Anything past 3,000 RPMs is bad. So we're gonna try this again with the flash I paid for. See how it runs. Custom tune. This is the SNS cam tune. This is an SNS 475 tune. All right, let's reflash it this one. All right, let's put you back on. Let's see how she runs now. I mean, from 3,000 RPMs on, it just rips. Okay, it's it's a lot better. Takeoff is a little weak, but man, you get on her, she, she rips. That tune is definitely better than the built-in tune. Okay. Now we are going to auto-tune. <clears throat> Let's see, auto-tune, enable. Left. Wait. Oh, 
basic. Basic narrow way, okay. Basic OEM narrow bands. So we are going to auto-tune the program map I just paid for. Oh, it ripped. It, that definitely made a difference. There's a lot more power. Alright. Auto-tune. Okay. Auto tune session one, get All right. Just flash the bike to the new uh, to the new uh, auto tune, and I'm probably gonna auto tune off of that tune. So we'll see if it runs any better. <laughs>
updated the auto-tune I just did and it runs beautiful but I'm going to auto-tune off of the auto-tune I just did for a few days to make it super 100% so I'm gonna do that so yeah definitely auto-tune the map they send you and then you gotta flash the bike after like a half hour of riding and it runs a hundred times better awesome Awesome, Dino Jet.